Hey folks, this is Johnny. Welcome to another home studio trainer show. Today we are going to take a look at removing a track and its instrument. Now, this is a re-upload from yesterday. I had some video issues with the last video, so I hope you don't mind checking this out again. If you guys could, I would really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you're over on Rumble, please hit the follow button. And if you would like to support what I do here, feel free to go to Patreon, click the link in the description and you can support me there all right so let's go right to the classroom and uh, when I made the last video uh, was um, I am right clicking and I am removing the track but my fader doesn't go away <laughs> why doesn't my fader go away all right so i'm gonna go ahead to a command z what you want to do is right click and say remove track and instrument done okay so what about the situation uh that you might have where you right click and you just remove the track what if you want if you don't want to go back and and put it back and then do it what if you want to just remove the channel if you forgot to hit the other option really simple you're going to go down here to this little icon let me zoom in. There we go. This little show instrument rack. You're going to click on that and you will see that if you remove the track and there's no other associated track, you will see that the instrument that you want to remove is grayed out. It is super simple. You can right click and say remove. You can also click on the little carrot and say remove. Done. Really? simple there's really not much else uh to say about that uh just in review make sure that if you want to get rid of both click on uh remove track and instrument and remember if you forget to that the grayed out instrument should be in your instrument list so now if it's not grayed out a big thing to remember is that that means it's associated with another live track. So make sure that you check that out before you do anything. If you're sure that it can be removed and it is grayed out, click and remove. Really, really simple. I hope you guys found that helpful. I would really like it if you could take a few minutes and check out my Amazon pick. It is the uh, Personas PD70 mic. If you use the link down below, you can get it for $97.99. I would really appreciate it. It helps support the channel. And I will see you all in the next video.